What's up guys, we're here at the 2013 Mitsubishi Owners Day. We got the Dino Challenge going on behind us. We got some cool Mitsubishis, and we also have the new D-Sport Limited Edition 4G63 shirt. Go get yours today. We're here with Mark DeSimone and his 2003 Evo 8. Go ahead and tell us a little bit about the car. Well, I've had the car for about a year. Right now it's on its second setup as far as a turbo build. Obviously it made 920 horsepower today. Dyno on a Mustang Dyno made 720. So when you started out, you weren't headed to a 900 horsepower car? No, not at all. I noticed some uh, shift sector stickers on your car. So you've been taking it out there and uh, running it at the shift center events? I have, yeah. And uh, what's the fastest mile per hour you've gone in the Evo? The fastest I've gone was, uh, I did 191. And okay. that was uh, the very first shift sector. We had the car on a kill, it was running 47 pounds of boost. So, I mean, it, it was a monster then. And and for someone who doesn't know, like the readers out there, or the, the people that are watching this, how does that feel, like driving that? I had the stock suspension on it and I had it at 700 horsepower. It was scary. It just felt, it felt violent, very violent and out of control. So I took it to Roby at Roby spec and he did a phenomenal job with the suspension. So doing the half mile roll racing, getting into it at 45 pounds, 45 pounds of boost and just taking off and hitting 190, it feels stable the entire time. The car just, just hugs the ground, doesn't get loose, it feels amazing. So well cool, congratulations on winning the dyno challenge. Hey, thank you. And uh, thanks for having your car on display for us today. Definitely. We appreciate it. We're here with Vic Chandra from Temecula, California, and his 2006 Evo 9. Uh, he came out with us for the Mitsubishi Owner's Day, had his car on display in the D-Sport booth. Uh, tell us a little bit about your Evo. Uh, it's a 2006 Evo 9, tuned on the 85. Pretty much built it from ground up. And uh, what made you choose to go uh, the E85 route? Get more power out of the E85. More power? The 91, yeah. And then uh, what are your future plans with the Evo? Or are you gonna stop here, or you, you wanna go more? I want to try to make uh, 500 plus. 500 plus? And what do you think it's going to take to get to that 500? Uh, I got a 30R sitting in the garage and maybe some more engine work. You know what your future plans are? You want 500 horsepower? Anything else you want to tell us about the Evo? Try to be different from everyone else. Don't want to have it like looking just like everyone else is. Right? It's my own thing. I like that. Hey, well, it's good to see you again. Thanks for having me. Enjoy. Hey, there we go. D-Sport, MOD, Mr. Vic. We out. Yeah, hell yeah. That was the best interview I've ever done. It was so easy. Like, normally it doesn't go that well. Wait, so, what do you really want me to say? What's up? Hi. How are you? How are you? Good, good. Could you take a photo of us, please? Do you mind? Sorry, I, like, I don't have it up. <laughs> they don't, I don't want, like, yeah, kind of close. Smile, ready? I totally took a picture of myself. <laughs> yeah, I know you did. What's a cute thing we can do like for a kiss? Car show? <laughs> you just asked. Just kiss? <laughs> oh my god. I'll do a leg lift. Can you take a picture of me doing a leg lift? Why don't I want to do, do that? I'll do something weird.